Hi, I'm Blair Lehman, Product Service Manager at Komatsu. In this episode of instructional videos on hydraulic breakers, I'll focus on two critical areas for optimum hydraulic breaker operation, positioning and applied pressure. Correct positioning of the hydraulic breaker on the working surface is critical to peak performance, machine health, and safety. The breaker must always be positioned perpendicular to the material so the tool moves freely in the bushing. The orientation may be vertical, horizontal, or anywhere between as long as the tool is perpendicular to the surface. This is especially important when using hydraulic breakers that continually test surface hardness to operate at an optimum impact force and frequency, such as the Komatsu V-Series. Proper perpendicular alignment is essential. Otherwise, the variable impact and frequency functionality will not operate as intended. Properly applied pressure is another essential factor when using hydraulic breakers. The operators should apply sufficient pressure against the tool to allow the ideal energy transmission to the material. Too little and you risk damage from blank firing. Too much applied pressure may lift your carrier off the ground, transmitting harmful shocks to the working tool, breaker and excavator as the rock breaks. Besides positioning and pressure, two practical tips can help you achieve the best results from your hydraulic breaker. First, break from the edge and work toward the center. Second, avoid prolonged engagement of the breaker on material. If the rock you intend to break does not crack in 15 to 20 seconds, lift the breaker and reposition the working tool in another location. This will increase your productivity and cause less wear and tear on your breaker. To see more in this series of hydraulic breaker videos, you can visit us at Komatsu.com.